Running of race number one, it's the Albert Hotel, benchmark 50, double barrel moves in, we're all locked away, set, ready to go, race one on the card, media hype, marking time the inside, muscle line stands up to it. Racing, Muscle Lines, one of the best to commence. Media Hype bounce cleanly. Bolt is up there in the early stages. Wacker Mahiro will settle back in fourth. They're followed by Divine Hunter, Lonergy, double barrel, Lanover immediately out the back. Keen contest onto the first corner. Wacker Mahiro, he's trapped deep, but he presses on. It's Wacker Mahiro taking the lead down the back straight. Moved away a length and a half clear. Second place would have been Bolt, a break back then to Media Hype. They're followed then by Muscle Lines, the Brum they're followed back in behind them by Divine Hunter. Lana G, well back, Lanover, and Double Barrel is at the tail end of the field. Wacker Hero, he's put back on the bit in front, and he leads by two lengths. Bolt is second. Media Hype third, the inside from the Brumby. Muscle Lines back on the inside. They're followed by Divine Hunter, Lana G. Lanover, and all the work to do for Double Barrel at the tail. Wacker Hero said, catch me if you can, as they run in the direction of the 400-metre point. He raced away. It's Wacker Mahiro five lengths in front. The Brumby is second. Bolt pushed along third. Then Media Hype Divine Hunter well back. But Wacker Mahiro he's in a world of his own at the 200 metre point. It's Wacker Mahiro. He's six lengths in front. The Brumby in second. Drawing hard. Divine Hunter and Lanover late but a one act affair for the fave. And Wacker Mahiro scores by four. Photo second and third. Probably Lonergy second in front of Divine Hunter. Then would have been the Brumby from Lanover Bolt, double barrel, muscle lines, media hype, last runner to get in. Number one, Wacker Mahiro, a good, strong, on pace performance there. He found the lead in the early stages and he really put pay to them coming to the corner. He opened up established a winning break approaching the corner and has been far too strong in the run of the line. One six four eight five are our numbers after the running of race number one to be confirmed. But as I said, a one act affair for the fave after race number one. Okay, these runners are to, returning to the scale here after the running of race number one. One, six, four, our numbers. One, six, four, the winner number one, Wacker Mahiro, defeating Lonergy. Third in the event, going to number four, which was Divine Hunter. The winner of the event, number one, Wacker Mahiro. He's a four-year-old Bay Gelding, owned by WJ Alston, Mrs. DP Alston and JL Wheelow, trained by Jared Wheelow of Rockhampton and ridden by Ash Butler. Second home in the event goes to number six, which was Lonergy, a four-year-old brown gelding owned by RT Hay, trained by Rodney Hay of Chinchilla and ridden in the event by Adam Sewell. Third home in the event going to number four, Divine Hunter, a five-year-old Bay Mia owned by J.E. Cairns, A.K. Simons, R.J. Simons and K.J. Miller, trained by Kev Miller of Rockhampton, ridden by Jenna Edwards. Just a waning on margins and time there after running of race number one. As I said, a one-act affair there for the fave. He bounced cleanly, put himself in the picture in the early stages, took over down the back and has raced away and scored easily. 
a good performance from him. Also, likewise, the runners up there, Lonergy, he ran on well from being well back in the early stages. And likewise, also running on was Divine Hunter from well back also. But all honours with the winner after the running of race number one.